hello there welcome to on this session and in this video today we are gonna launch one small web thing here like if using a Apache server and first of all like if we have been creating one small website there and let's see how to launch in Apache server right so the thing is we have using is Amazon AWS cloud here and I have been launching one of CentOS machine there and uh, we have uh, some files in desktop it's uh, a few files i have been created like a uh, two pages one of home on about self one of website and it's a html file let's see how to add these files on our ec3 instance so first of all uh, we start our instance there right so uh, how we can like uh, add a uh, files and windows desktop to our instance so for this uh, we have to use a few commands there and the command it's and i have already been created there and how we can clone the our files on our instance and you can see see there our files windows desktop to edc to instance so what we using a command there there is nothing but i will explain you one by one right now here and first of all uh, we gonna make a So we just like you trying to update our server and once you update it we're gonna install the Apache server here So once you install your Apache server and we have to make a directory called HTML there cd slash web slash alright so we are right now in HTML directory right so we we have to add some like uh, our files here which files we are using to uh, deploy on our website and let's see we're gonna add here so in this uh, command there is nothing but I use there my pemki name and which uh, pemki means I have been using to launch my ac instance and after that I use a hyphen r and I just like to take my folder name here and which folder I'm gonna add there like you can see demo and these files we are going to add our instance right and I paste my pem key here on this folder and after that I use like a, a my instance name and other date and public IP there and this public IP and I will show you where I can where we can find it so once you uh, use your public IP of that is a colon and then where www.html the folder which folder we are in working on our instance all right so present directory we can uh, mention there so once you like uh, add this command and just copy this command
go to your windows and so what we gonna do there we just like you go to CD2 in desktop and we have a uh, with the folder name my web right all right so we are in our present i mean working directory which directory we have a file here so what we gonna do there we are going to paste there this command which we are prefer there for it so before uh, uh, like uh, use this command we miss something there we have to install our inst instance like uh, we have to mention one command there we need to copy in present working direct right so this command should be like important if you haven't uh, used this con command and you can't like a uh, copy files on your certain instance it's it says like a permission denied all right so and you can see there our all files will be moving to our instance like which i have been created and html files and categories and images and all this kind of things will be paste over ec2 instance And it's take a few minutes time because we have adding a lot of images and also files there that's way all right so i was thinking it's done right now there and let's see and this file will be add our instance or not so uh, we just are in html direct right and once you press list all files you can see there are our html files still add our instance categories and like a which pictures we are using there and everything will be on our instance right so uh, what we can like a check there start our apache server and it deploy or not right so for this we are going to syst uh, using a system ctl command
so once you start your apache server and you just gonna see there we are successfully deploy or not It's like a saying can't reach right so I think we missed something like if we had to add in security groups So we're gonna add other, other rules also. So once you add this uh, HTTP and HTTPS protocols to your EC2 instance, then let's see we're gonna try right now with here. It's work or not. copy this public IP and boom it's working you can see there our website it's uh, I mean it's successfully deployed it's great right and I hope you guys usually can understand and if you have any doubt of questions about this you can leave me in comments alright